are you ready to make a move to the beautiful and the friendly province of New Brunswick? Well, if you are a first time home buyer, you are in the right place. Today, I am unlocking the doors to your home ownership dream in New Brunswick. And I guarantee that by the end of this video, you will have the keys to the successful home buying journey. So please, please stick around because I am about to dive into first time home buyer in New Brunswick, your complete guide to home ownership. Let's get started. Brunswick. New Brunswick is a fantastic place to call home with its vibrant communities, friendly neighbors, and the lower cost of living compared to many other provinces. But why buy a home in here? New Brunswick offers a winning combination of 1. Affordability, 2. Quality of life, 3. three economic opportunities, 4. Cultural richness, five excellent education and the six healthcare and the welcome community i truly truly feel this way now but when i moved to new brunswick from japan in 2008 i didn't feel new brunswick was a good fit for me i was comparing new brunswick to japan as you know japan has lots of going on and a fast pace and I had friends and a family and my career. So I was homesick all the time. And there are not much to do. Nightlife, you, you should forget about that. So I didn't have any friends, couldn't work. My English wasn't that good. I was so, so close to mind about New Brunswick. But now I have fantastic friends here. Love the community. They're so friendly. I have my career, I love this friendly community and the slow pace, family oriented life and the nature. There are many Facebook friends groups for people who moved from other provinces. Many, many immigrants compared to 2008. It's more dynamic uh, culture uh, diversity here compared to 2008 when I moved to New Brunswick. Multicultural Association, which have so many programs to the newcomers. My advice to you is to join some programs or groups to get to know people. Now let's talk about the financial side of things. Preparing your finances is crucial when you are a first time home buyer. Increasing your credit score is one way to help you get a lower mortgage rate. If you have good credit, at least 600, uh, you should be able to get the mortgage approved from most of Canada's larger mortgage providers, which are the ones that tend to offer the lowest mortgage rates. The saving is also an important aspect of your home buying journey because why? You will need your money saved for your down payment and the closing cost. I will be in touch with these two subjects later on. Okay, Coco, I understand. I understand. But Coco, I don't understand. What type of mortgage do you have in New Brunswick? Okay, I got you covered. We have a conventional mortgage, high ratio mortgage, fixed rate mortgage, variable rate mortgage, open mortgage, closed mortgage in New Brunswick. New Brunswick offers a range of mortgage options to suit various financial situations and preferences. Whether you are honing for a conventional or high ratio mortgage, a fixed or variable rate or choose between an open and or closed mortgage there is a situation that can help you achieve your home ownership goals of course i have a local trusted mortgage lenders who can guide you through your home buying journey in new brunswick sometimes it is for your benefits to have a mortgage lender locally because the seller's agent know he or she locally 
so it will give you credential for your mortgage approval okay got it coco but how does the home buying process work in new brunswick let's break it down step by step First, mortgage pre-approval is a very important first step on your home journey. It helps you understand how much home you can afford. It is so heartbroken when you fall in love with a house and find out you cannot afford it. Please don't put the product on the cart before you know your budget. Also, when you make an offer on a home with a pre-approval in hand, sellers tend to view your offer more favorably. It shows that you are a serious and qualified buyer. If you are the seller and you see the offer with a pre-approval letter compared to without it, I am sure you will feel the same way and that's my point. In same cases, pre-approval may allow you to lock in an interest rate for a certain period, protecting you from potential rate. But Coco, how to get the pre-approval from the bank? I got you covered. Gather your financial documents, choose a lender, submit your application, and await your pre-approval decision. Once you have your pre-approval letter, you can confidently start searching for your dream home. Next, you hire a real estate agent in New Brunswick. Before we dive into the process, let's understand why hiring a buyer's agent is advantageous. Buyer's agents have in-depth knowledge of the local real estate market in New Brunswick. They can provide insights into neighborhoods, property values, and the market trends. Agents have access to a wide range of property insights. The benefit of working with a buyer's agent is that they will work for your best interest. Hope you will call me to become your buyer's agent in New Brunswick and have fun! Okay, next is how to do a home research. Well, this is my way of serving my buyer clients. First, I will set up a Zoom meeting or face-to-face -face meeting to get to know each other. Knowing each other is a key to be the same page for this process. Then, I will set up an automated email system directly through MLS. So anything new comes on the market, which meets your criteria, I will email it to you so you will not miss the opportunities. When you see something that you are interested in, I will do a virtual showings if it's not possible for you to come see it in person. I will give you a market report in the neighborhoods, advice on the price and the conditions and some tactics to win multiple offers and make an offer. Of course, there are lots more into it. If you are interested in working with me, please give me a shout! Please, please, please! And next, I will walk you through the essential legal and closing process that takes place as you near the completion of your home purchase. The first step in this phase is to find your trusted lawyer you will need to hire a qualified real estate lawyer or notary public in new brunswick they will handle the legal aspects of your transaction ensuring that all documents are in order and the sale process goes smooth reviewing legal documents is also very very important your lawyer will review all the necessary legal documents. And this is very, very, very important. Please do a title research and review the property survey and the title search. You want to make sure that you are purchasing what you think you are buying and you want to make sure you are buying from the people legitimately on the property and the house your lawyer and the real estate agent should do their diligence but please make sure to ask them <sighs> okay 
Now we're getting to a finish line. Please stay with me. After you find a lawyer, make sure you're purchasing what do you think you are purchasing from who owns the house. The next step is mortgage approval and financing. If you're financing your purchase with a mortgage, your lender will finalize your mortgage approval. As you approach closing, you will need to prepare for closing costs. These costs can include legal fees, property transfer tax, home inspections fees, and insurance. In New Brunswick, the lawyer's fees are about $1,500. It depends on which lawyer you will hire. Home inspection fees are about five to $700 for a single family home. Inspection will performed about seven to 10 days after offer acceptance in normal housing market. And you will need to pay to the inspector after the inspection. Land title transfer fee will be the biggest cost to you. This is a tax to the government that the buyer has to pay upon closing. You will have to pay $1 to every $100 purchase price. So for example, if you purchase $200,000 house, you will pay $2,000 to the government as a title transfer fee. Finally, the big day arrives, closing day! On closing day, your lawyer will facilitate the transfer of funds from your lender to the seller. You will also sign all the necessary documents, including the deed and the mortgage documents. Once all funds and all the documents are in order, you are officially take possession of your home. Congratulations! You're officially a homeowner in New Brunswick! And that's a wrap on our complete guide to home ownership for first-time buyers in New Brunswick. Remember, this is just the beginning of an exciting journey. I would love to help you to navigate the journey to and have fun. Stay tuned for more insight into the home buying journey in New Brunswick. I will put the link to get access to my buyer seminar. It's a series of minute and a minute and a half videos explaining how to buy a home in New Brunswick. I hope this series of videos is going to be very helpful for you. And if you're finding this information helpful, please don't forget to like this video, share it with others, and subscribe to more exciting journey to home ownership in New Brunswick. And I will see you at the next video.